Good day, grade 5 students. Welcome to science class. Before we start our online class, let's follow our online classroom rules. First, sign in or log in your account 10 minutes earlier before the start of class. Second, kindly mute your microphone unless you are asked to speak. Third, look at the screen. Fourth, listen carefully. And fifth, kindly click wave icon if you have something to share. Alright, please prepare your pencil, pen, paper, and module. Thank you! After going through this module, you are expected to 1. Classify materials found in the environment according to its use as personal body care products, cleaning agents, medicines, farm chemicals, and reagents food. Number two, identify useful materials at home, in school, and in the community. Number three, explain how different materials become useful to the community and create a product that shows the use of materials at home or in the community. Now, let's answer, let's learn. I will read the directions, so listen carefully. Choose the letter of the correct answer and write it in your answer sheet. Number one. Anna wants to clean her teeth. What personal body care product should she use? A. Bleach B. Facial cream C. Lotion or D. Toothbrush and toothpaste The correct answer is Letter D Okay, let's answer. Let's try. Directions Choose the letter of the correct answer and write it in your answer sheet. Are you ready? I'm giving you one minute to answer the activity. You may click the post button to post the video while the pupil is answering his or her activity. Now let's evaluate your score. Like 100% if 10 items is correct. Heart 80% if 8 items is correct. Wow 60% if 5 items is correct. And sad 45% if 4 items is correct, thumbs down if 20%, meaning 1 item is correct. Now let's answer. Let's recall. I will read the direction, so listen carefully. Directions. Choose the letter of the correct answer and write it in your answer sheet. You will choose your answer inside this box and you will write your answer inside the column. If the product is according to personal body care products, medicine, cleaning agents, farm chemicals, or reagents food. Are you ready? I'm giving you one minute to answer the activity. You may click the post button to post the video while the pupil is answering his or her activity. Now let's proceed to Let's Explore. I will go into read the direction, so listen carefully. Identify the following materials found at home, in school, and in the community. Write your answer in a separate sheet. Number one, what can you see from this picture? Very good. It means it's a table. It can be found at home or in school. Now it's time for you to answer the following pictures from number two to number ten. You can do it. Are you ready? I'm giving you one minute to answer the activity. You may click the post button to post the video while the pupil is answering his or her activity. After answering the first activity from Let's Explore, now let's proceed to the second activity. Here are the following questions, so listen carefully. Number one, from the given pictures above, what are the useful materials that can be found at home? in school, and in the community. You may write your answer in the space provided. Number two, why do you consider those materials useful? Why are they useful? Why do you think they are useful? You may state your answer or you may write your answer in the space provided. Number three, how did you classify the materials? Number four, why do you need to know the uses of the different materials? Number five, 
Why do you need to classify the materials if it is useful or harmful? Are you ready? I'm giving you one minute to answer the activity. You may click the post button to post the video while the pupil is answering his or her activity. Okay, class. There are materials that can be found at home, in the school, and in the community to improve your health, destroy harmful organisms, and make life more comfortable, make work faster and easier, and help protect and conserve the environment. These materials can be classified in the following. One of classified useful materials that can be found at home, in the school, and the community is what we call personal body care products. These are used in personal hygiene, in caring our body, and for beautification. And some of the examples is what we call lotion, shampoo, bath soap, cleanser, and toothpaste. Medicines is one of the useful materials that can be found at home, school, and the community. These medicines help people fight diseases and illness. The examples are vitamin supplement, antibiotic, mifenabic acid, and cough syrup. The next one is what we call cleaning agents. Cleaning agents can be described as any products used to clean. The example of this is chlorine, dishwashing liquid, floor wax, muriatic acid, and detergent powder. Okay, the next one is what we call farm chemical. Farm chemicals are substances used in agriculture, farming, and gardening. Fertilizers make soil rich for plants so they will grow well. So fertilizers are helpful but could kill if too much of them is applied to plants. So another one is what we call pesticides. Pesticides help us rid of harmful insects that may infect our plants. However, they can poison plants and animals if too much use. So the example of farm chemicals are pesticides, fertilizers, and herbicides. Okay, last but not the least is what we call reagents food. The reagents food are substance that is used for food preservatives and additives. These are the materials that are considered useful when it serves a purpose. Some materials are useful because they are used for cooking, food, cleaning purposes, or destroying harmful insects and keeping us healthy. So the examples are starch solution, salt, sugar, and food color. Now let's answer, let's dig in. Directions. Identify the letter Qs in column A with the corresponding uses of the materials given in column B. Use a separate answer sheet in order for you to answer this activity. Are you ready? I'm giving you one minute to answer the activity. You may click the post button to post the video while the pupil is answering his or her activity. Now, after answering the first activity in Let's Dig In, now let's proceed to the activity B. Write the use of the following materials as to personal body care products, medicine, cleaning agents, farm chemicals, and reagents food in your answer sheet. So like for example, number one, dental floss. You need to answer if dental floss is according to personal body care product or if it's a medicine, cleaning agents, farm chemicals, or the agent's food. Kindly write your answer in the space provided. Thank you. Are you ready? I'm giving you one minute to answer the activity. You may click the post button to post the video while the pupil is answering his or her activity. Now let's answer, let's remember. Directions. Answer the following briefly in a separate sheet. Number one, give three examples of materials and give its useful effect in the community. So you need to think of three examples of materials that is useful in the community. Number two, how do your materials substance become useful to human and the community? Are they useful? Number three, how should we use the different materials found at home, in school, and in the community? There are different ways in order, in order for us to use the materials, so you need to clarify on how are you going to use these materials.
Are you ready? I'm giving you one minute to answer the activity. You may click the post button to post the video while the pupil is answering his or her activity. Let's apply directions, analyze the situation, and answer it briefly in a separate sheet of paper. Here's the tip. You need to read carefully and analyze the situation before answering. Number 1. Yaya knows that monosodium glutamide is, or what we call MSG is useful as food enhancer. He loves to eat processed foods and it contains a lot of MSG that can harm his health. As a friend, what will you advise to him? So example of monosodium glutamide or MSG are Nam Nam, Ajinomoto, and Magic Syrup. So write your answer in the space provided. Number two. Kayo is thinking on his safety to the different bacteria and viruses in their surroundings. What useful material will you advise him to use and why? Are you ready? I'm giving you one minute to answer the activity. You may click the post button to post the video while the pupil is answering his or her activity. For our next activity, let's answer, let's evaluate. Directions. Choose the letter of the correct answer and write it in your answer sheet. So you need to read the question before answering and write the letter in the space provided. Are you ready? I'm giving you one minute to answer the activity. You may click the post button to post the video while the pupil is answering his or her activity. Now for the next activity, let's extend. Directions. Make a collage about useful and harmful materials using pictures from old magazines and newspaper. Write two or three sentences to describe your output. So you need to have old magazines, newspaper, scissors, and glue. Okay, in your collage activity making, there is a rubrics to follow. So, the team subject is clearly expressed if it is excellent, good, or fair. Artwork is original. Work is done neatly and purposely. I will be the one who will going to rate your output. Thank you. After studying and answering the modules, the parents will return it to the school using Dropbox. Please follow the schedule of distribution and retrieval of modules. Thank you. Before we end this video, I would like to say thank you for watching and I hope you learn a lot. Study hard and achieve your goals. See you in our next video lesson. Goodbye!